Hey guys, today we are going to do a tour of College Lane campus, which is one of the two campuses of the University of Hertfordshire. Right now we are at the Forum Hertfordshire entrance. It is fairly easy to get here, it's only a 10 minutes walk from Galleria, Edfield's most famous shopping centre. It's a 30 minutes walk from Edfield Rail Station and a 20 minutes walk from Edfield Town Centre. Next to the many bus stations is a nursery. The day nursery is open on the weekdays and offers on-campus childcare facilities for students and staff. Right in front of the nursery is the Forum. The Forum is the main social facility for the University, so let's go explore. So the ground floor has an entrance hall. It has a 400 cover restaurant over there, it has a convenience store named Premier and over there it has Starbucks and Subway, among so many other great facilities. Ok, so let's go to the first floor. Ok, so on the first floor we have an ATM machine and we also have three entertainment venues with a 2000 person capacity, perfect for hosting events such as live performances from international singers. Big Wednesdays was the biggest student night here at Hertz, with a different team every week, in the main area, the style bar and the attic, but it's not currently open due to the pandemic. Right next to the first floor forum entrance there is the international office. The international office can give you information on a variety of subjects, including how to apply to this university. You also have this store called Computer Fixes that offers IT services to all university members with personally owned computers at special discount rates. Here we also have a hairdresser and right next to it we have Strots. Strots is a letting agency that provides the free service to help students find off-campus accommodation. Ok, so now let's check Ellie House. Ok, so located in the square next to the forum is the Ellie House. The bar hosts weekly karaoke nights, open mic nights, pub quizzes and many more events. Ok, now let's check Uten Hub and see what he has to offer. The Uten Hub features a social place with relaxed seating as you can see. Some services provided include Student Support Center, Careers, Employment and Enterprise, Student Wellbeing Counseling and Disability, Medical Center, Hertfordshire Students' Union and Occupational Health and Safety. Let's see what's next. All of this is still the Uten Hub. We are passing by the main building where a lot of lectures take place. This includes the School of Computer Science, the School of Engineering and Technology and the School of Physics, Astronomy and Mathematics. This is the main reception. This is the place you need to go if you lost a belonging or if you want to collect your free face covering. It's a very nice place to come to relax or even to study. So let's see what it looks inside. All next to each other we have the Mercer, the Lindup, the Todd and the Art and Design buildings. Students that are in the School of Creative Arts have lectures in these buildings. In the Art and Design building we have our largest exhibition space. 
We also have the Gallery Café right behind us. We also have the art shop with a wide range of creative materials. This next building is called Film, Music and Media Building. It contains two types of accommodation, teaching for students in the School of Creative Arts, like Miguel, and technical support space. This is the Innovation Center, where the university develops plans of collaboration between the education, research and commercial sectors. If we make a detour to the right, we can find a hillside house. Here it is. This is the right building where students from the School of Life and Medical Science have lectures. In here we can also find HIC, which stands for Hertfordshire International College. It provides undergraduate and postgraduate pathways courses that result in the award of a University of Hertfordshire degree. So if you want to study here or are already studying here and have an, any question regarding your course or your HIC accommodation, this is the place to go. The science building provides spacious naturally lit laboratories, a pharmacy, adult and children's ward, teaching space and social spaces for the students of School of Life and Medical Science. The science pod is located in this building and it is the perfect spot to grab a coffee and some snacks in between lectures and classes. Hi guys, we are in a new day and today we'll show you the rest of the campus. This is the LRC, the Learning Resources Center. Let's check it inside. Here you can find the library, computing services, and facilities supporting the student's academic journey. The LRC offers thousands of print books available to borrow, a range of study areas, access to PCs, Macs and iSpec counting rooms, printing facilities, and Wi-Fi and power throughout. Now I'm going to show you the on-campus accommodation, available for all students here at College Lane Campus. The accommodation is divided into six courts, the Bellingham, the Spalding, the McLean, the Newton, the Schofield and the Telford. Each court has a common room and a laundry room and there are a variety of different types of rooms to fit every student's needs with prices ranging from 100 to 210 pounds per week. If you are interested in seeing a room inside, you can click on our room tour video here. Now that we've seen all the courts of the campus accommodation, we're going to see the oval. The help desk on College Lane is located in the Oval. This is also where you have a lot of active student sessions such as Zumba, Yoga and Krav Maga and a gym with several membership plans exclusive to students and staff at the University. The Oval is the place you need to go to collect your parcels or to rent a free University bike for a day. Now we're passing by the courts of this campus. Here you can participate in active student sessions such as tennis, football and basketball for free.
The key offers quiet spaces and places to pray, meditate or relax. It hosts weekly spiritual events and activities and also offers well-being support. We finally reached the end of the tour, we're back where we started, in the forum entrance. Like always, we really hope you enjoyed this video. If you have any questions, feel free to comment down below. And if you want to see a tour of the other campus, the Diavolant campus, or any other type of video, let us know. See you in the next one, guys.